So I went with my girlfriend to her cousin's wedding in Tijuana last weekend. Damn, dude, you had to go all the way to TJ? That's what I get for dating a spick. I thought she was Indian. Oh, shit. I use the same book in science. What if this dork's in my class? Ain't that some ironic shit? It's coincidental, idiot. Whatever. So, uh, was it crazy loco? What? The wedding in TJ. That was insane. Tequila, senoritas. One dude even died. What? Dude. Did someone really die? Yes. Was it the groom? No. Oh. Was it someone in the bridal party? Shut up. Can I tell the story? So we partied like Mexicans, which that part rocked. Then we did the wedding, and that sucked. Afterwards, we all line up outside, and the bride and groom come out. Tequila. And all the guests started pulling out their guns and shooting up in the air. That doesn't really happen. Uh, what are you talking about? Mexicans don't really do that. Yes, they do. No, they don't. It's just a stereotype. Some stereotypes are true. Yeah, well, not that one. Bitch, who was at the Mexican wedding? You were. Yeah. Oh. So anyway, after all the shooting and shit, this old beaner just drops dead. Well, he just fell over? No, oh, he died, dude. Apparently, when you shoot guns up into the air, you know, usually the bullets get taken away by the wind or something. Not uh -huh. today, my friend. Uh -huh. Came right back, landed in this old dude's skull. Oh, did his head explode? No, it didn't explode. What are you talking about? Don't be dumb. Quit being an idiot. No, we all thought he had a heart attack until we rolled him over and his head was squirting blood. Cool. What did you do after that? Well, after that, <laughs> kept on partying. Party. <laughs> <laughs> the hell is going on? Christopher? Mr. Thompson! Wait a second, you know this guy? Dude, he's my science teacher. <laughs> How you doing, Mr. T? What's up, dude? Not much, Chris. What What is going on here? What is, what's happened to my place? Well, uh, you made any bad bets recently, Mr. T? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. You're a gambler, Mr. Thompson. Me, too. <laughs> you shouldn't gamble, Chris. So what is this, like a shakedown? We weren't supposed to be here when you got home. Check that shit out, Mr. T. I'm late to work just like I'm late to class. <laughs> and you're not gonna try to hurt me or anything? Oh, no, 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 That's not our department. We're just here to mess shit up. Oh, sorry, stuff up. <laughs> well, good job, I guess. Thanks. Tell your boss that I'll have his money on Friday. I talked to Lee already. And secondly, you shouldn't be doing this kind of work, Chris. You're so young and so smart. You're too smart for this. No, uh, I'm not that oh, smart. Yeah, he's not. Hey, shut up, retard. You shut up. You shut up. You shut up, you retard. You oh, retard. Oh, you shut up. You're gonna shut up. Don't you son of a bitch. Whoa, 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 whoa. Boys, 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 boys. Calm down. Nothing. Calm down. This isn't the type of work that either of you should be doing. You're two intelligent young men living in one of the most prosperous countries in the world. No one really gives a damn about us. You're wrong about that. You think the system's turned its back on you and you're angry and you're frustrated, but you gotta believe that there's people out there in the world that care about you. Both of you. And I'm one of those people. I don't step into that classroom every day for the glory of teaching or the money or the benefits. I do it to help make young people into better citizens, citizens the world can be proud of. You guys could be anything. You could, you could build governments. You could, you could design Jungle a, gyms. Jungle gyms? I was going to say skyscrapers, but sure, you could do, you could do anything you want. You could be president. Really? I could yes, be president? Yes, you can. Well, mate, you could, yeah, sort, yeah, possibly. You could, but you just got to try. You just got to go out and do stuff. You got to, you got to work for it. You can't do this work. You have to do this work. <sighs> Sorry we messed up your place, Mr. T. That's okay. I'm not concerned about all this stuff. I'm concerned about you, Christopher, and you. You. So 
Just go out there and just do the best that you can. That's all that really matters. You can do it. Thanks, guys. What the fuck? Okay. Now, did you see how I used the center of my foot? Mm -hmm. And I placed it just below mid-center on the door. What the hell is happening now? Now, I want the two of you to go to the Home Depot. I want you to get a feel for the thicker woods. This is valuable information. This is gonna come in handy for you. Like, like this one time, me and JJ, we had to go up to this big Jew mansion up in the- Wait, a mansion full of Jews? <laughs> no, Christopher, there was one Jew. He owned it, it was a very large house. Oh. Now pay attention. So, we get up to the front door, and JJ, oh, he's all amped. Oh. So he pulls back his foot, and he slams it right into the center of the door, and he shatters his fucking shin. <laughs> it's not funny, you see? The door was so thick that when the fat sheeny came to it, he answered it because he thought we had knocked. It ruined the night because I had to shoot the Jew and I had to take JJ to the hospital. So we didn't have time to do the fun stuff. Do you understand? What the fuck's the matter with you? This is a nice pillow. This is Pottery Barn, this is nice. Who are you? This is Mr. T, right? Yeah, that's Mr. Thompson. You really don't know what's going on? You're the boss? Yeah, as far as you need to know, I'm the boss. Well, I just thought that... <sighs> Ow! Shut up. Ah! Come! Now you see, this is how a real man takes control of the situation. Any jerk off can pistol whip a son of a bitch and break his jaw, but a real man can slap a man into submission. That way, they know that you got him by the balls. I got you by the balls. Say it. You've got me by the balls. What's right here? My balls? Your balls are right here. I got them. I'm holding your balls. Can I try it? Give it a shot. Ah! Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Thompson. Hey, er, don't be a pussy. All right, good. <laughs> hey, look at me. What's your name? Harold. Harold, you're a fucking loser. You gamble too much. That's why I sent my two young associates here to your house this morning to toss it, to send you a message. Now, they were supposed to be gone before you got back, but young Christopher here has some time management issues. Yeah, I tried to, you know, talk to him. Shut up. Now, I appreciate what it is that you're trying to do for these boys. I mean, really, I do. When they came to me this afternoon and they said that they didn't want to do this work, I respected that. But then, do you want to know what Christopher told me he wanted to do instead? What? Shut up. He told me he wanted to be a senator. A senator! This crazy bastard is never going to be a senator! I've personally seen him piss on kittens just for fucking fun. It's on YouTube. It's really popular. All you have to do is type piss on kittens. Sorry. And then this one. Stevie tells me that he wants to be a painter. That doesn't seem so bad. You know, actually, that's not so bad. I told him he could dabble, but only on your own time. That's good. Shut up. Shut up. Now, the point is, it's people like you that are the problem for kids like this. I don't want you dragging him into your web of unfulfilled dreams. I'm sorry. Don't say sorry to me. Get out. I'm sorry, Stevie. I'm sorry, Christopher. You guys are good at this. This is what, what you should do. OK. 
Can I paint you? No, no, Stephen. Okay, we got an understanding here. We're good? Everybody happy? Yeah. See you in class, Mr. T. That's enough. Let's go. Okay. Come on, boys. Let's go get some pink berries. My treat. Ah! Oh! Oh! Stop gambling. You're not good at it. You have yourself a good day, Harold. Oh. Christopher? Mr. Thompson! You made any bad bets recently, Mr. T? I've personally seen him piss on kittens. It's on YouTube. It's really popular. All you have to do is type. Can I paint you? Let's go get some pink berries. My treat.